hi friends good morning welcome to the next tutorial so in this tutorial we'll concentrate on uh, login using this uh, json async task so first i'm creating one separate project for that so on the name of login so on the name of login so i'm changing my workspace so I'm changing my workspace to this separate one so I'm creating the project next next so finish so meanwhile we'll observe this our uh, login page so last time what we did with the registration in the last tutorial for the same respective uh, we'll do this is the login one so here uh, mobile number is the uh, login mobile number and password using the mobile number and password we can log in here along with the action so for the same url we'll observe so first we'll observe this request in a postman then we'll start our project so first i'll uh, copy with this url so this is also the post request so just i'll copy this url in a postman so I'll paste that URL. So I paste that URL. And the next it should be this is the request. So I'm copying the request. So copy the request and uh, paste in a postman. So in this this is also the post. So in the body, I'm pasting this request. So one number. So we got this success here. So data, so it is working fine. So now in place of this, just I'm changing some of the other mobile. So just I'm trying with this. So I'm getting here failed. So here, whatever the responses is given by the people, so it should be acceptable. So a uh, fail and success case. So now we'll start, so web service is properly working. So we'll start the program. So here, uh, in X, first we'll start with XML file. So I'll I'll style uh, design first XML file. So in XML file, as usually I'll change to our regular layout. The tree should be the uh, linear layout. So I'll change the linear layout. So on this linear layout, I'll add two parameters. Uh, one is the edit text. Other one is the button. So here for this uh, edit text, two we required. For the first one is the mobile number, and second one is the password. So third one is the button. So I'm changing here linear layout. That linear layout orientation should be here as a vertical. So in this, I drag and drop to edit text plus the one button. So I'm drag and drop this to edit text. Otherwise here we'll create directly here. So directly here we can create, so edit text, so edit text, so match parent, wrap content. So for this, I'm giving you some ID, that ID should be here, mobile, so this should be this mobile, so mobile, and then it should be the hint is the, I'm giving you as the mobile number, mobile number. Then uh, we need the second element. So that second element should be here. So for this, I'll give you one more thing. That should be this input type. So input type is this is the phone. So then the second element, it should be the password. So I'll copy and paste this element same as this. So it should be this. This I'm changing as a password. So pass. So this is the, I'm changing this as a password so password so then input type is here this should be this text to password so then i'll take finally one button so button so match parent wrap content then for the button i'll give you some id so id is for id i'm in so id i'm giving you as login so id as a login then i'll write here some text on the button so that is also login done so then i'll comes into java file so our design is ready so now i'll comes into this so as usually here first i declare this button and i edit text 
so which we did the same in this last program almost similar they should be also so edit text so in this edit text i have those two edit text so first one is the mobile second one is the password so i like to then here next step should be this is for initialization so login equal to find view by id r dot id dot r dot id dot so this should be also login so id is the login and then mobile mobile equal to find view by id so r dot id dot so it should be this so mobile and then the last one should be this is the password so here password equal to find view by id find view by id r dot id dot so pass so done so next here for like when you are creating when you click on the button so it should uh, log in with that so here for that one i am applying the on click listener so button dot on click listener done so up to this it should be the common then after this here we are creating one uh, json request so for the json request here we need to create one json object so json object equal to new json object so new json object so in this i want to pass few values so how many values are there here so first one is here key and value so it is expecting some exception so here we we'll add that exception here first then here total we need this total three values one is the mobile number other one is the password and the last one is the action so this is one so we can copy paste the keys from here so first key is the here mobile number is the key and mobile number and uh, second is the second is the password so password then password password so password sorry it is wrong bit so password okay and paste the password then last key should be here this is the both are the same so b action so b action and uh, next is the login user so last time it could be this register user now it should be this login user so login user and then i'll paste this login user here done so now we need to pass